streets. They're noisy, they're messy, and they're taking over a Brentwood neighborhood. Dozens of birds have residents there fed up. Here's the catch. The egrets are a protected species. KPI X5's Don Ford on the simple plan to deal with this flock. It's everywhere. It's thick. It's deep. Starting to just accumulate, accumulate. Lots yes, lots of it. The chair right there is completely covered. The floor is completely white. The, the rocks were gray. Now they're white from the bird poop. It started months ago when egrets, some say as many as 50 or more, started nesting in this tree. The egrets, which fly between the United States and Canada, are granted protected status. And it wasn't just the poop that annoyed everyone. They're big and they're very loud. loud. Very loud. They make very Long loud noise. squawking noise. Yes, and they will do that all night long. Next door, Danielle Whitrickis used to have a green grass backyard for her two kids. It was green and then we had plants all around. It was beautiful. Everything is dead. The birds destroyed it all. Even her daughter's second floor bedroom window is a mess. There's this eggs, broken eggs, and um, dead birds. Nesting season is over, but there are still dead chicks that fell out of the nest weeks ago. Now that the birds are gone, the city-owned tree is being deeply pruned, trimmed back so egrets don't find them so attractive next time. One neighbor says the summer was right out of a Hitchcock movie. Love that movie, Birds. Classic movie. Classic movie. I'm glad they're not pecking out our windows and trying to kill us. <laughs> they're pretty. They're pretty chill, other than the poop and the noise. Otherwise, Ethan says he is hecka glad the birds are gone. In Brentwood, Don Ford, KPIX5.